it's that red thread of what we've been talking about in a way, isn't it? It's that you start starting where the child is and thinking about where they can go and noticing along yeah. the way rather than looking at the destination and thinking, how the hell am I going to get them there? I don't know, and as a parent, how do you know how to get your child to write so you think to where your last reference point was that you can remember and often start there? So we've split the app into six broad streams of development like fine motor gross motor cognitive development. And basically, we've looked at child development uh, and everything is backed by science and research. So it's the science of how children develop. And the app basically says to parents, if your child is here, then this is potentially what's coming next. And there's always a potential word in there. And here are some interactions, activities and experiences that you can have with your child based on things you've got in the house, kitchen cupboards, whatever mm. it may be, or in the park or just outside the or door. Or Tesco's. Or Tesco's. So nothing expensive you need to buy. And you can do these things while you're making the tea or in a more planned interaction. And they will support your child to develop these skills. And here are the things to look out for. So it really is about giving parents information to help them to support their children's development. Amazing. And what, what's next for you, both with My First Five Years and all your other projects? Are you working on anything else at the moment well, or full steam ahead? No, yeah, no time to work on anything else. Full steam, like we did there, just bringing in the steam reference. So My First Five Years is launched on the App Store with Apple. It's been featured by Apple four times now, which is great because it means that they like us. Um, and so we are just building our My First Five Years community. And then for ABC Does, it's just more of the same. I am going back to conferences this year for the first time in two years. I know, proper face-to-face -face stuff. So I've got three of those this year, which I'm really looking forward to, just getting back out there, as well as the kind of in-school work. And just because I wasn't busy enough, I'm also in the final 12 months of my doctorate in early years. So I'm at the writing up stage. So yes, I've done all the nice research that I really enjoyed. I've just not got to write intelligent stuff about it.